Hey, what's going on guys? Tony here hanging out. And I just wanted to talk about, you know, how buying and selling cars changed my life. <clears throat> it really did. And it was a skill set that I learned early, early on in my teens. I was actually 12 and 13 years old when I started to actually buy and sell 50cc scooters and mopeds when I was a young kid. You know, before that I was delivering newspapers uh, to close to 300 homes every day after school. And um, my biological dad said, hey, why don't I teach you how to flip scooters? And my stepfather donated his first, his first scooter to me. And um, I was able to sell that, not for a huge profit, but I had some money to invest into new deals and make more money as I rolled it and snowballed it, you know? So I just wanted to say that <clears throat> learning the skill set of adding value to something is very, very important no matter what you do in life. You could be selling anything, cars, mopeds, dirt bikes, things off Craigslist, appliances. If you can take something, an item, a vehicle, whatever, and add value to it, make it look better, make it more presentable, and write an ad or record a short video that sells it, you can make a profit. And there is huge opportunity in this and people are making a ton of money every single day, millions of dollars combined, probably tens of millions of dollars, billions of dollars. I mean, if you think in the, at, from the whole bird's eye view perspective on trade and selling, um, sorry guys. It's, it's, a, it's a billion dollar pyramid, right? A billion dollar circle, not a pyramid, but a circle that just keeps going around and around. Trade, everything is bought and everything is sold. So why not take your piece of the pie, get in there, learn how to analyze and find deals, whether it be cars or whatever. In this video, we're talking about cars. Add value, but you don't wanna to add too much value because if you add too much value, you're gonna take away from your profit, okay? You wanna add just enough to where it's presentable, saleable, in good condition, you can flip it, make a few thousand dollars in profit, and you repeat the process over and over again for thousands of dollars in profit for every flip that you do. And it's a beautiful thing once you, once you gain this skill set, it's, you just have to learn it once. Once you learn this skill set once, you can repeat the process over and over and over again anytime you want. You can do it once a month, once a quarter, once a year if you need the extra cash flow, 10 times a year. And if you add the profits up, it can be huge. It can be tens of thousands of dollars per year in added value, added income to your bottom line. You know, you might be doing a side job, you might be full time working, and, and you know, you could just weave this into what you're doing for extra cash to support your family, um, to buy extra things, to go on vacation. And it also doesn't matter where you're from. You could be a total newbie and never flipped a car before. You could be experienced, you know, and you could be coming from a car dealer lot. You know, I've had a lot of guys that I helped out that were actual used car salesmen that wanted to get on the inside and flip cars for profit on their own without going through their dealer and making more profits because they see how the game is done. Um, and there's a lot of scammy things going on as well. Um, the word curb stoner, where does that come from? Well, that comes from dealers that use dealer lots or new car dealer lots, right? Stealing the sale from the dealer. So say I would go into your dealership wanting to trade in my caddy for a brand new car they'll basically say yo they'll basically be like hey the dealer is probably going to give you 15 grand for it you know you you, you could probably get much more i'll give you seventeen thousand for it and blah 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 and basically slip them the number do the deal outside the dealer and that guy is basically a curb stoner the dealer 
the the seller working for the dealer, right? Because he stole that the deal from the dealer. Okay, I've never done this. I've never worked at a dealer. This is just from you know from what I heard and from people in the industry. Then he goes out and retails it for twenty two or twenty five grand. Okay, and makes that difference in profit. So those are people who do deals like that are curb stoners. Okay. Hold on, let me shut this gate. Am I close? Am I touching the right button? All right. So again, it's Tony here. If you want to learn how to flip cars for profit and make a really, really nice extra income, you can do this. You know, I started with really practically nothing, and I've went through the the period of not making much money on cars. You know, um, investing too much in cars that I flip, where you break even and only make maybe a hundred or two hundred bucks, and you're glad you got rid of the deal. I've been through a lot of that through you know through my years of doing this. So if you want to learn more about flipping cars for profit and you want to avoid the pitfalls most common people make, um, I have a free book right over here. If you want to click that guide up there, is a free guide that shows you exactly how to flip cars for profit. Um, check it out all right or you can click the link down below if you're on youtube click those links check out the free guide i'm sure you'll get a lot of value from it it's tony here from how to buy and sell your cars.com have a great day it's a little cloudy today and muggy whatever it's tony here have a great day please like the video share subscribe and i'll talk to you soon